We've got another episode of Showtime Wrestling tonight. Tonight's matches are looking really cool. We've added a few more members to the roster. And uh, the upcoming match, Master Ken versus Thanos. And it looks like Thanos has all the Infinity Stones. Does Master Ken have what it takes to be victorious tonight? It's taking forever to load, so it might take a bit longer to actually see what's happening. Oh, here we go. All right. The fans are hyped, and here comes Master Ken. Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 245 pounds, the superstar, Masters Ken. He looks, he looks ready. Pure aggression. But will it be enough to stop Thanos? Pop-Tarts. The pop got in the Pop-Tarts last night. Sorry, this broadcast has been interrupted by an alert on uh, my dog eating Pop-Tarts. Like a retard. Oh, oh, and Thanos has the exact same entrance. And That's his fine. Opponent, Look at this man. From the other side of darkness, weighing in. 220 He's pounds. here to eliminate half Batman, of the Showtime roster. The Thanos, the big man, looks ready. Master Ken, Thanos, mad from Wii Sports, the referee. Oh, and Thanos flipping Master Ken over. Oh, a reversal. Oh, another reversal. God punch from Master Ken. Oh, a knee to the head by Thanos. Master Ken got him up against the ropes. What will we see here? They're just kind of standing around. Oh, Matt breaks it up. Master Ken looking strong here. But uh, Thanos not having it. Hard on the back, and a punch to the head. Skull crushing blow. Master Ken rolls out with Thanos on top of the ropes, getting the fans hyped. Master Ken back in now. Thrown up against the turnbuckle and a clothesline. Oh, we have a pin already. That's not enough to hold Master Ken down though. Thanos is gonna have to do more if he wants this victory tonight. 
Master Ken easily gets out of the hold. Neck breaker by Master Ken. A good, a good steady attack by Master Ken. He, he's looking to gain back momentum. Oh. That was great. A good move by Master Ken. Oh, a vicious attack to the arm. And then slamming the hand. Oh, Master Ken for the pin. But no, Thanos not done yet. He's ready to snap. Oh, blocked by Master Ken. And then another neck breaker. Master Ken in full control of this one. This move again. Oh, no. On a knee. Oh, blocked in a gut punch by Thanos with the Infinity Gauntlet. Is this a Batista bomb from Thanos? Couple punches to the head. This. What do we see? A face drop on the ropes. This has not been Thanos' day so far. A clothesline from Master Ken into the turnbuckle. Oh, a chokehold from Master Ken. Will Thanos break it in time? Is this is this the end? Matt from Wii Sports scratches himself real quick. No, Thanos is out. Thanos is out. Punch to the face. DDT from Thanos. Is this enough to beat Master Ken? We're going to find out. It's not a one count. Thanos somewhat uh, somewhat in disbelief but he's going to go up top a menacing attack an elbow drop but it seemed to have missed Thanos trying to gain control you think a man with the power stone won't have to worry about that Master Ken just overcoming all the powers of the infinity stone oh buddy Kick is blocked there. Thrown out of the ring. Thanos humping, pumping up the fans. And uh, he's picking up Master Ken. Outside of the ring, we're having a brawl. Thrown down by Master Ken. Thanos. Up against, against the barricade. And rammed into it. Wow. Punch in the back. Thanos is having by the head. Are we going to see it again? We are. Bam. Oh, Master Ken's back has to be in pain. And a neck breaker. I think Thanos has this one, guys. Oh. The big purple man catching his breath. Matt from Wii Sports looks on to... Oh. This can't be good. This is not good here. Yes. Bam! And a pin. And that's that's it, guys. Master Ken was not enough to beat Thanos. Oh no. That's Eminem. What is happening? Oh, there he is. Clothesline! Master Ken getting beat twice tonight! This rivalry just got a lot more heated. Let's see what the next match is. It is me! I'm gonna hear it's me! It is! It's yeah. DJ up against Venom! Yes! Yeah, Venom and DJ, both relatively new characters. Yeah. I wonder, I wonder what this match will hold. Maybe a potential rivalry here also. What is Venom gonna do to me, Christ? What is Venom gonna do to me? And also, real quick, to um, like to announce the uh, 
the beginning of a new show with uh, most of the same superstars, really. But it's gonna it's gonna show on Tuesday night. It's gonna be called uh, Tuesday Night Throwdown. Make sure to tune into that too. Sh Showtime is gonna be specifically Fridays, and then we'll have Tuesday Night Throwdown again, featuring all of the same character, all the same superstars, all the same divas, with same championships. Just different nights, different matches, different rivalries. Oh. It's it's the beast. Venom Making with his an way amazing to the entrance. Ring from New York, weighing in at 640 pounds, Eddie Brock. I'm not sure if Venom weighs 640 pounds, but, um, sure, we'll go with that. I like Venom. I like Venom. He's slithering like a snake. Why does he have small hands? Alrighty, and now comes DJ. And his opponent from New York, weighing in at 130 pounds, the ladies' man, DJ Paul. Paul, here's DJ Paul. Who will win this match? This night already exciting. Will this match be enough to set it over the edge? And we're only two matches in. I can't wait for the main event. Look at Venom menacing standing outside. Matt from Wii Sports sets us off. Oh, Venom starting out real strong here by already slamming DJ. And a stomp to the face. Oh, but a reversal from DJ. An uppercut from Venom has DJ stuck up against the rope and now he's down on the knee. Slammed into the turnbuckle by Venom multiple times now. This is just a vicious assault. This is not looking good for DJ. Oh no. A scorpion. Oh. A cool flippy thing from DJ. And now a kick to the back and a stomp to the chest. Oh, an uppercut from Venom. Into the turnbuckle. Oh, reversed by DJ. Oh, and then head punches. This has been a pretty evenly matched fight. That one appears to be hurt in that leg. Are we going to see a pin already? We are indeed. Matt from Wii Sports with the count. One. And that's it's just not enough to hold Venom down yet. Punch to the face. Oh. Another pin. DJ looking to win. Another one out, though. Venom back up to his feet. Oh. A spear. And then a suplex. And then just a straight up slam into the ground. A kick to the chest and now he's, he's done. But a reversal. He's actually still in this. But Venom making sure he he has this victory. Oh, a knee to the face. 
Oh, a reversal by DJ. Almost saddening. DJ is almost as tall as Venom is when he's on a knee. I know we have a chokehold, I think. That's what it looks like from here, folks. But it's not a good enough hold. And now Venom in the turnbuckle and a clothesline from DJ. Oh, another attack there, huh? And then reversed by Venom. DJ, a little out of it now. Thrown in the turnbuckle. Again, 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 again. More vicious attacks from Venom. I'm not sure how much more DJ can take. But he's still back up on his feet. And a backbreaker. A great move from DJ there. Are we going to see another pin? No, he's going to bring... Oh, it's reversed. Shoulder check by Venom. Surprisingly enough, Venom has dished out a lot of damage and hasn't gone for the pin yet. What is what is happening here? I Oh, this is a hold of some sort. And it's broken out of by DJ. Venom still in full control of this one. Puts DJ up against the ropes. Oh, and he gets flipped out. DJ reverses it. Now we're going to see these two fight outside the ring. And Venom still with control. And another, he's just throwing him around at this point like he's a rag doll. Matt from Wii Sports not happy that the two are outside of the ring. Oh. This can't be good. Oh. A pile driver. And Venom slides back into the ring. And he's uh he's getting the fans into it. DJ's up. And he's back in the ring just in time. An uppercut from Venom. A reversal from DJ. DJ fighting back, but will it be enough? Does he have what it takes? to make it back into this match. He's gonna try. One, two, oh, kick out a two. Venom not done yet. DJ a little upset, thought he had the match, but he didn't. Oh, a kick from DJ. A reversal from Venom. And a close one from, oh no. That landing on your back can't feel good, but he rolls away from the next attack, but he gets uppercut and thrown out of the ring. Oh no, he speared out. Both superstars are feeling that one. Yes. Oh. Yes. Is, is Venom going to go for a pin here? He is indeed. This this is probably the match. One, two. No, a kick out right before Matt hit the mat a third time. Venom definitely thought he had enough. Oh, this is a charge finisher. A choke slam, vicious choke slam from Venom. That should put this one away. That's a one, two, yep, that's it. Venom has won both, both Marvel characters so far have, uh, have won Thanos and Venom. Look at this vicious, viciousness from both competitors. Whatever that was, that was kind of weird to watch. Not even going to lie about that one, folks. DJ showing a lot of potential in his first match on Showtime. Sadly, could not come away with the win.
Venom here with the pin. Look at how here high is your that winner, is. Eddie Brock. DJ rolls out of the ring. Let's let's get to the next match. Super exciting so far. It's Matt versus Goku. The match we've all been waiting for. After a heated promo two two episodes ago and uh a match between Matt and uh, some somebody else I don't remember who it was. But uh this this has been a long time coming. Who will come away victorious? Who will be able to say they are the best? We're going to find out here soon. Here we go, guys. Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 220 pounds, Matt! Okay. All right, here comes Goku. And his opponent from out of this world, weighing in at 267 pounds, the super athlete. It's supposed to say the super Saiyan, but that just that didn't work out. Alrighty, let's get this fight underway. Goku with the first hit. Alrighty, folks, uh, I'm gonna hold on to Tomkin for a second. Matt here seems to be in control. Yes, Mom.
Oh, a punch to the face. Is Goku taking control over this one? Oh, Matt with the reversal, but then a missed punch. Oh, a knee to the gut. Goku cannot... Oh, pin already. But a kick out of one. Goku's not done here yet. I see. Oh! Slammed into the ground. And the ropes. Oh, a vicious elbow to the face. And then uh, warming the crowd is Goku. A stomp that seemed to have missed. Matt brought up to his feet. And then the same gut. Goku's gonna go for the pin now. I don't think he's gonna get it though. No, kick out at one. Matt, too tough for Wii Sports Boxing Champion. A chokehold now. Cold didn't didn't get him to to quit, but it did do some damage. And now an uppercut from Matt, and a clothesline from Matt. A DDT from Matt. Matt in clear control. This can't be good. He's looking up. Goku slow, and it's that Samoan slam we like to see. And here's the pin. Is it enough? Does Matt have it? No, he doesn't. So close. He can't believe he didn't get the three. The other Matt from Wii Sports obviously not siding with the real Matt from Wii Sports. Oh, but an uppercut from Goku. Goku's not done yet. And then a DDT from Goku. And he's going to go for the pin. A kick out of two. Goku can't believe it. He thought he had won. Oh. And maybe he has. He's ready to strike. Here it is. No, it's reversed by Matt. And another DDT from Matt from Wii Sports. The Wii Boxing Champion really is trying to prove he he is the best. And then a face drop from Goku. Getting the fans into it. A reversal from Matt. Oh, a reversal by Goku. Into the ground goes Matt. And the chokehold again. Goku really seems to like choking out Matt. But from the appearance of it, Matt from Wii Sports does not like the chokehold. We're going to see another pin. We are... No, we're going to see a fist drop. Kick to the back. But Matt's back on his feet. This, it is indeed. All right, a pin one, two. Oh no, another kick out of two. Matt arguing with the other Matt. And into the into the mat. I love you too, DJ. Okay. Oh. I love you so much it hurts. Okay. Oh, GDT from Goku. And a pin. Is this the end of Matt? It's not. It's not. Matt kicks out again right before the three count. Probably had some help from the other Matt from these sports. He's getting up slow. Goku looking at it again. Does he get it this time? He does. Is that enough? Will this be enough? We're going to pull him to the middle of the ring. 
Goku for the pin. He's won. Goku taking the victory over Matt. So, so far, Thanos, Venom, and Goku have come out victorious. We're going to see a handshake here? Or? What is happening? Oh, Goku's going to go for the handshake. Matt, no, Matt's not having it. Matt's like, oh, bro, I should have won that. Goku trying to add some friendliness to this rivalry after the amount of heat that has been brought, but it's not Matt. Who would be waiting for? I don't know. We're just commentating, dude. All right, now we have Alice versus Chimmy Paja. Um, now it is believed that Chimmy Paja is is some kind of weird creature that's a mix between Fiona from Shrek. She exists, but she does. And she's going to go up against Alice. Alice on a roll after that amazing defeat against Jeremy. Jeremy, Jeremy, Jeremy. If you can beat Jeremy, I feel like you could beat anybody. Jeremy. And Alice has. Alrighty, let's get this match underway. Yeah, 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 yeah. So once and I got to them. And it's Alice Making Baker. Making her way to the ring from New York. Sweetness, Alice Baker. I don't I have no words I have negative words is she wearing a t-series jacket is she going against PewDiePie if that is if that's the case I wanted to lose for that reason alone Oh, a kick to the knee by Alice. But well, Alice gets kind of slapped, and then there's that. Jimmy Pajar. Ow. Alice down. But Alice is coming back. Again, after that stunning victory over Jeremy... You can't expect her to lose. Oh. Oh, but that, that kick missed completely. Here's a fiction hold that seems to take no effort from Chimmy Fizal. What's uh, all right? Alice is not done, but she she didn't make it out. Oh, rejected by Alice. Caught in midair. Oh, a leg hold here from Alice. Bounced off the ropes. A pin already. Kick out at one. Alice, too strong. A kick to the back of the leg from Alice. A scissor kick from Alice. Rejected. 
There's that again. Oh, cutthroat from uh, Chimmy Paja. Sorry about that, boys, but we're back. Alice, again, seeming to be in control of this match. And a pin? One. Uh. Alice with the same hold. And a knee in the back. That can't feel good. I just now noticed that. Reversed by Chimmy Paja. Oh, a vicious slam. Is Alice going to lose? No. Reversed by Alice. Swept her legs right from under her. Can Alice come back and win? With a slam like that, it's possible. Ten, one, two. So close, Alice was the victory. No, there's no water in your head. No. How do you see wet on your head? This could be it, folks. I think Alice has got this. One, two, no, so close. She's arguing with Matt from these folks now. Stomp to the hand. Reversed by Chimmy Paja. Slammed by Chimmy Paja and a pin. No, Alice will not lose today. Oh, from up top. But Alice is getting up. Oh, but she didn't she didn't get up in time, rolling out of the room. Up now. Lays out across to me to draw. Reverse. Reversed again, but to no effect. And then a suplex. This is not looking good for Alice. Oh, slammed into the post. I'm thrown back in the ring. But we're not going to see a pin, surprising. Can Alice pull out a move to win? Is that enough? Is that slam going to do it? Reverse shoulder check. Oh no. This might be the end for Alice.
Another vicious over the back swing. A pin. Alice lost to Chimmy Paja. The frightening creature that should hardly be considered woman. I'm I'm kind of hurt. I thought Alice could win after after her victory over Jeremy, but I guess Chimmy Paja, a newcomer, had other thoughts. Let's hope that the next back match turns out to be better. For everybody tuning in, I, I'd like to uh, take them take the time to thank you for supporting the channel and uh, Classic Productions in itself. I've seen a lot of excitement tonight from uh, the Matt versus Goku match to uh, everything else. It's transpired so far. Thanos and Venom showing that they have the potential to be on Showtime. Here is your winner. Matt and Goku queen. living up to the hype. This match sadly kind of put a damper on my night. My little brother, super fast. Alrighty, the next match. Chuck Norris doing a promo. What what could Chuck Norris have to say? Chuck Norris also a newcomer to Showtime. But I'm, I'm looking forward to this. Chuck Norris is one of my all-time favorite people on the planet. And uh, if Chuck Norris is watching right now, which he always is. Chuck Norris is always watching. I just I just want him to know that I appreciate everything he's done for the world. Let's, let's hear what Chuck Norris has to say next. Here he is, already in the ring. He's not happy. Hey, WWE Universe, you guys know that I try to keep a level head, but I want to talk to you about something that's really been grinding my gears since it started. It takes a lot to get me riled up, but once this tea kettle starts whistling, there's no cooling me down. I'd hate to see... Who, who's gotten on Chuck Norris's bad side? There's a superstar in the back who wanted my attention, and boy, did they get it. This isn't good. So, if you all want to see it, I think that Victor Slavitsky and I should have ourselves a match right here tonight. Victor Slavitsky is angering Chuck Norris. That's not good for Victor Slavitsky. We all know what happens when you anger Chuck Norris. And here he comes, the Viking Victor Slavitsky. Victor Slavitsky not looking too happy. And he's going to come and struggle to find the mic and then find it pretty well.
What does Victor have to say to Chuck Norris? Before I say anything else, I have to apologize to the WWE Universe. Apologies that I let this guy ramble on as long as he did. Man, I would have come out sooner, but I was nodding off back there. Now that I'm out here, let's get down to business. We're going to see a fight. What is Chuck going to say back? Look who it is, the man, the myth, the motor mouth. Clearly you have some reason for being out here, so why don't you do us all a favor and say what you have to say and get the hell out of here. Chuck Norris was asking for a fight, and now, now he wants Victor to just say what he has to say. Ooh. I want to see a fight. I want to see Victor Slavitsky get completely annihilated by Chuck Norris. I just want to remind people that there's something other than you in the WWE. It can be easy to forget that since you take up so much time with your blabbing every week. Okay, first of all, Victor, this is Chuck's first night on the show. Okay, but uh, again, I have supreme confidence that Chuck Norris would crush you in a match. What does Chuck have to say? For all the trash you talk, you might uh, want to switch careers and become a garbage man. That way you'd spend as much time on trash as you like. Or just buddy up with management more. We all know that trash gets trash. And they might be able to help you more than you can help yourself. Chuck Norris kind of reframing himself from completely and utterly annihilating Victor Slavitsky. It's, it's Chuck Norris and Victor Slavitsky. Someone like you should have no problem testing your luck with me in the ring, is that right? If that's the case, I'd be more than happy to give you a personal lesson as to why I'm the best superstar in the WWE today. I mean, if you're feeling ob obliging, my bad, don't know how to read. Clearly, you've got a screw loose or something because you don't know who you're messing with. That's a fair point. I'm not just a superstar, I'm one of the best damn superstars the WWE has on its roster. If you want to face me in this ring, that's fine with me. I have no problem making you look bad in front of millions of fans around the world. And Chuck Norris would. I'll save you the trouble of having to go for an actual match with me, so I'll know I'll win. No amount of cheating or assistance will help you either. You won't be able to weasel your way out of this. Victor Savitsky is speaking with some very high confidence. What does Chuck have to say? Who the hell do you think you are? You think you've earned the right to come out here and talk smack to me? You haven't earned yourself a parking space, much less than the right to talk to me. You better get back stage before I decide to get angry. Now Chuck Norris is being Chuck Norris. Thanks for showing up tonight. Seriously, I appreciate hearing what you had to say. Now I know I have nothing to fear from you. You all talk, no action. So anytime, any place, if you still want a match, I'll gladly put you in your place. Victor Slavitsky thinks he has what it takes to beat Chuck Norris. And we will not see a fight. Let's get to the next match. All right. It's it's me going up against Sub Zero. This should be a decent match.
Alrighty, let's let's get underway. Making his way to the ring from Aurora, Colorado, weighing in at 195 pounds. Oh yeah, uh, just has up all the championships have been voided because uh, it has came to my attention that it's not fair for people to just just get them without earning them. So that'll be uh that'll be the event for this month. We'll have a we'll have a big title match. And now here comes Sub Zero. And his opponent, from parts unknown, weighing in at 230 pounds, Sub Zero. Sub Zero with a with a pretty cool entrance actually. Can I beat a Mortal Kombat character? Matt from Wii Sports standing outside the ring. It's Sub Zero. Me, Sub Zero. Oh, Sub Zero comes out strong. Ah. Neckbreaker from me. Stomps. To the head. And then a knee to the face. Taking nothing from Sub Zero. Oh, but a reverse. And a clothesline out of the ring. Ow. Ow. Oh. Oh. Oh, but I come back. Spinning kick to the to the gut. The punch in the face from Sub Zero. Oh, this isn't oh, but it's fine, because I got right out of that. Throw him back into the ring. Pushing him to the side. Throwing his arm. Oh, kick. A stomp to the face. Father Pa showing no remorse. Oh, reversed by Sub-Zero. Oh, leg drop on the face. But I'm back up. And the clothesline... Right into the clothesline into the turnbuckle. My bad. And a pin already. One. Kick out at one. Sub-Zero's not down yet. He's back to his feet. But I am not. I don't pin from Sub Zero. He got a one, almost two, almost two. Uh, I'm gonna just chill out on the ground real quick. Oh no! Reversed. A miss. Face punches. Again, taking nothing from Sub Zero as he rolls out of the ring. 
to avoid getting beat up anymore. Now I'm out. Elbow to the face. Back in. Waiting for Sub to get back in. Oh. Maybe don't stand up against the ropes next time. This can't be good. A Batista bomb. Into a pin. One. He got a one. Not done yet. Can't ever count Father Paw out. Landing hard on my back. Oh, and a knee. Stomp in between the shoulder blades. I'm guessing this is a choke hold. This is this is a bad angle for that move. And a pin again. One. Break out at one. Father Pawn needs to get up. Oh, a choke hold. Well, I get out. I don't think I'm getting out. I don't get out, but I survive. Go away from the kick. A backbreaker. And I'm talking. Or am I out of breath? I'm not sure. Punch to the face. Oh, reversed. The reversed. A kick to the back of the knee. Punch to the back of the head. Oh. Matt, can't believe what's happening. It's an attitude adjustment. And a pin. Not enough. Not enough. Bringing him up. Oh, a Batista bomb of my own. Into a pin. And that's it. Sub-Zero didn't really seem to stand a chance in that match. That was a good move by Sub-Zero. Also a good move by Sub-Zero. Oh, that's what was happening there. Okay. I'm trying to snap my neck. He's going for the fatality. But he got attitude adjusted instead. Is it going to show the Batista bomb? Here is your winner, the great Robert Paul. So your winners so far, Thanos, Venom, Jimmy Pajablo, and me. It's been a good night. It's been a real good night. Oh, and Goku. Goku beat Matt. Next match. I'm pretty sure this is the last one. The main event. El Jefe versus King Alec. A heated rivalry. Potentially for the Showtime Heavyweight Championship.
Oh, my bad. That's on me, folks. We will see this next match. Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 640 pounds, El Jefe, the Eagle, El Jefe, Van Sisley. And his opponent, from Babylon, weighing in at 443 pounds, the King Alexander Abbott Tanaka. Here comes the man I expect to win, the King. Oh, they want the same route, but they both missed. Oh, denied by El Hefe. Reversed by King Alec. Neckbreaker from King Alec. And I'll have this in a bad position here. Ow. A triangle hold. Well, it doesn't last long. Ow, a neck breaker from El Jefe. Thrown over the shoulder with King Alec. And missed stomp. One of the ropes by El Hefe. A fist drop from King Alec. That arm is probably dead. We're going to see a pin? No. Oh. It's that Samoan slam. 
from El Jefe. But reverse by King Alec, and he's going to unleash an amount of punches right to the face of El Jefe. And a pin. Okay, out of one. El Jefe definitely not done yet. All reversed by El Jefe. And a elbow to the face. Damn. Reversed by King Alex. A DDT. It will be enough to put El Jefe away. It is not. And uh, he glitched up for a second, but he can't believe it. Close lines down to the ground. Brought back up, reversed by El Jefe. Oh, and he's sizing him up. Never mind. Reversed by the king. From up top. This is where it gets dangerous, folks. This is a straight belly flop right on top of El Jefe. That might be enough. No, a reversal by El Jefe. And a DDT from El Jefe. Can he put King Alec away? One, two, no. It's not enough. Dismay. Sizing him up. This isn't good for King Alec. It's the Samoan. It's the Samoan slam again. And the pin. I think he's got it. One. Two. He does indeed. El Jefe comes away with the victory over King Alec. A good night of matches this evening on Classic Productions Showtime Wrestling. And here we're going to see all of the best moments all over again. That probably wasn't one of them, but it was fine. A DDT. Well, that was the last match of the night. Thank you guys for tuning in. We'll have more for you Tuesday night. Um, then if you're new to the channel, please, please subscribe, make sure to like this video and comment on it, um, tell us who you'd like to see added to Showtime next, and, um, yeah, thanks guys for the support, we'll let the replay finish and we'll, we'll look at a review of the night. Here is your okay. winner, Happy. El Jefe, the Eagle, El Jefe, Van Sisley. He did good. El Jefe is a strong competitor. It was a good night of wrestling. All right. Thanos beat Master Ken. Venom beat DJ. Goku beat Matt. Chimmy Pajablo beat Alice. Chuck Norris lost in the promo to Victor Slavitsky. I beat Sub-Zero. And El Jefe beat King Alec. That's it from us for tonight. Enjoy your evening, guys. Next time on Showtime Wrestling. Actually, it'll be in Tuesday night throwdown, the next episode. Well, we'll see you then. Enjoy your evening.